<clears throat> I thought I would uh, show this because I thought it was worth mentioning for anybody who may not know. But uh, this is a jewel thief. I wanted to show uh, how you can basically control the amp draw and the output with a magnet. I think that's the easiest way rather than using uh, a resistor. I think a magnet would probably be the best idea. I mean, we're changing the frequency at that point, so we're changing uh, draw and output also. But all that's going on in the toroid. This is uh, Tesla technology in disguise right here. That is a Tesla biofiler coil right there. Uh, that's what a Tesla biofiler is supposed to be. And the uh, opening and closing of the magnetic flux that's going on there, in there, that's what's providing the pulse and the spike and all that. But, we have a magnet here. Moving that further closer to the core is what is, is how you change your uh, frequency over here. So I'm going to turn it on. So, I got a cap hooked up. It's charging this cap right here. So right now it's, it's running as it is, the way that it is, with the resistance and at this particular frequency. I can hear the frequency. So now it's charging this cap, and it's not going to charge. Uh, it's going to charge it up to a certain point because it's only pushing out, probably right now, a maximum of 1.5 volts, and that's a flat battery too. But I'm gonna take this magnet and I'm gonna move it nearby, and watch what happens to the voltage. goes up dramatically. So now I've increased my draw dramatically and my output is probably somewhere around 3 volts now so it's double. And the frequency has gone up, the pitch has risen. Take it away. Climbs a lot slower now, if, if at all. So just using a magnet, you know, we can, we can, we can you can move it around and listen to the frequency, the pitch of the frequency change, and from there, audibly determine uh, your draw if you want to. Just using simple magnets. So, without the magnet, it barely wants to charge this cap beyond 7.5. It's going very slowly. Put the magnet back charges it no problem. Alright, that's it.